Ladies and gentlemen, um, okay, so I want to show you how to download, um, show you how to download something in a zip file and then, like, is it a folder or a collab conglomeration? That sounds like the terriblest word used there. Terriblest is not a great word used there either. So I'm going to show you how to put a bunch of stuff in Google Drive, okay? Mainly folders, because usually if it's just a, a file or something, you just drag and drop it in here and it'll upload. So, right here, I've used a uh, teaching thing, so TESS, which is our um, evaluations procedures. Um, I've got this zip file, okay? It's a bunch of folders and domains um, that we use that we want teachers to put a bunch of stuff in, like their artifacts and all the stuff that they use to show their the phenomenal teachers. So, in here, I would click this right here, the download button. I could click this and put it straight in my, uh, in my Google Drive, but I don't want to go straight in there because it's still a zip file. A zip file is when they take a bunch of files and they mash them together and it takes down the file size and also keeps everything the same. Like if you send a picture, a lot of ways, um, or a lot of times when you like email a picture or text a picture, um, it's going to lose a lot of its quality and its, uh, its resolution. Like uh, if you've ever noticed when you record a video with your phone and you text to somebody, it looks way worse on theirs than it does yours because they compress it. But what here what they do is they essentially tighten everything up and then uh, you're able to go in and, and extract those files. So I hit this little thing and that's just going to download it to my computer. See? Right there. Boop. It's on my computer. Now um, I don't want to drag and drop this in here. I could drag and drop it in now, but then it'll still be in the zip file and I need to open it. So um, whenever you download it, if you're using a PC, it won't pop up here. You have to go to your downloads folder wherever that is and then you'll see it okay now there's a couple ways to unzip this um here on a mac you can right click um i don't know why i said that so loud um on a, i'm sorry not mac on a pc when you right click there will be an option here that says extract all and you'll be able to click that and it'll turn it from the zip file into a folder it looks like that that's what me doing it earlier i on a mac i can just double click it and it makes my folder right there okay so it's got my folder that's what I want all right see how it changes the look of the little fella and plus it doesn't say dot zip on it um, if you double click it it'll do the same thing on a PC if you double click the zip file it should just unzip it automatically do that or right click and do extract all now from here you see this file in your little downloads your little your little documents area wherever it is it went to just take that folder you drag and drop it into Google Drive. Okay, it's a great way to put files in there. You just drag and drop them in. Now I've got this uh, folder I created just for this. That was my template I had earlier. Drag, drop, boop. you'll see it uploading right here. Boom, done. Awesome. Now, a little caveat of this. You have to be in Google Chrome, okay? Do not use Explorer or Firefox or anything else. Um, if you're using Google Drive, you can upload files in there automatically um, in any browser. However, if you want to dump a whole folder in there, then they're going to make you use Chrome. And the way, reason they do that is because it makes people use Chrome more. And all this is done by Google, so they want you to use a lot of their stuff. Okay? So that's why they do it. There's my folder. I can double click. You'll be able to see both of these. And then you're done. That's it. You just import the folder into Google Drive. That's what's up. Say howdy, mom.